Hi guys, I hope you're doing great. And welcome back to another episode of the Pedal Porn Hub. Um, on today's episode, we're going to be looking at a really, 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 really rare pedal. Uh, I don't know how many there is on the earth, but probably less than five. Uh, I don't know, I've never even seen. I've seen one other one, um, which a guy found and he's been put on a forum. But apart from that, I don't know if I've seen another one out there. It's the Burns treble boost um, now this was released in 1965 um, that was actually the year that Burns sold to Baldwin and then the next year they did the Burns buzz around which is of course the one um, which is really, you know, the holy grail everyone talks about but this was the uh, predecessor to that and it's just again it's so rare they must have handmade a few and then stopped it for whatever reason. It's, it's, it works quite differently to a normal treble booster. A normal treble booster sort of enhances all of the frequencies and the overall output. So this one works in a slightly different way to a lot of the other uh, treble boosters you see from around that time. It actually only increases the treble frequencies and it doesn't actually reduce the bass response um, and again, a lot of treble boosters normally, you know, accentuate the whole output, but this is not, this is really only focusing on the treble frequencies. On that note, it's not that drastic compared to a normal treble booster. Normally when you kick on a treble booster, it's, you know, it's, it explodes everything, but with this, it just seems to enhance in little areas. It's nice. Um, again, I, I went for a more bluesy, um, Steve Ray Vaughan like style playing because that's all I know but <laughs> so this Burns treble booster actually uses uh, an NKT213 uh, red dot transistor which is now considered one of the holy grail transistors from the 60s and right rightfully so it sounds really really warm and um, just yeah really vintage and nice you know it's got it's got that, those characteristics to it um, but yeah all in all a very very rare and quirky cool pedal um, looks like a little robot <laughs> But um, yeah, I don't think you'll you'll see one of these on uh, you know in a lot of places. Hope you guys like the sounds. Again, they're not not too drastic, but um, just a, just an overall enhancer and a sweetener, I suppose. But um, yeah, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. Uh, please subscribe and maybe tell one of your nerdy friends, um, <laughs> nerdy pedal friends, to watch if you think you'll like it. But thanks a lot. I really appreciate it, and catch you soon. <laughs>